In the book of Matthew, Jesus says something extremely interesting, and that is those who love basically their mother and father or son and daughter more than him aren't worthy of him. What is Jesus saying here? Let's get into it and stay tuned. Thanks everyone for checking out this episode of Acting Up Ministries. Remember, most of you who are watching actually are not subscribed. We just reached 50 subscribers and that's awesome and I want to keep reaching more subscribers and reaching more people with the gospel. So please remember to like, subscribe, comment, share the video, and help spread it across platforms. On to the video today. Again, it's gonna be one of those informal ones. We're kind of just walking around the house again. Um, my wife's getting ready. We're about to be going out and getting donuts, I think. So when Jesus is telling us that if we love our father or mother more than him, we love our sons or daughters more than him, we're not worthy of him. And just before that, he talks about coming to turn fathers against sons, daughters against mothers, all that. What is he saying? Well, what Jesus is definitely not saying here is to hate your mom or dad or your kids or your family or anything like that. Jesus isn't telling people to hate their family, but he's bringing up a very important lesson that I think a lot of us Christians nowadays need to know. I was talking with someone recently and I was expressing basically, you know, this kind of issue uh, going on. And he brought this verse to my attention and God started working on me with some stuff. And I realized something about really what is God saying through this verse? It's not that we're supposed to hate our family, but we're supposed to love God so much that no matter what, we're gonna follow him. It's not saying that we shouldn't care about our mother or our dad or our sons or our daughters or our wife or anyone like that. No, rather what it's saying is that we shouldn't be putting humans above God. See, a lot of times what we do is we get stuck in the church building we're going to and the people there, or we get stuck with what our family believes. And what we do is we get scared to follow the truth because where we at currently, we're family with those people. We love them. Now, there's nothing wrong with loving the people you're with. You should love your family. You should love the church you're a part of. You should love the people in your life on a day-to-day -day basis. If you don't, then there's probably an issue. But when do we make the decision where we have to say, all right, do we love the truth, the word, the word of God more than what we find comfortable? As Christians, we should always be pursuing the truth. We should be studying God's word every day to find out what it truly says. And if we are in an area or with people or following a group that doesn't align with the word of God, then that is where this verse applies. If we love the group we're a part of, if we love our mother or father, or our son or daughter, if we love people more than we love following the truth of God, then we're not worthy of him. It can be scary to be leaving a group that you realize isn't following biblical standards. We have to ask this question to ourselves and ask honestly, who do we love more? Do we love the comfort of the world, the familiarity of people, the families we build in communities, or do we love Jesus more? And if we love Jesus more, we should be all the more willing to always seek his truth. So this is what he's saying in Matthew. He's not saying to hate your mom and dad. He's not saying to hate your son or daughter. He's not saying to hate the family you've built in communities. What he's saying is when you value them more than you value the truth that is in Christ, you aren't worthy of Christ. Meaning that we need to value Christ more than anything else we value in this world to be worthy of him. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope that something in this episode spoke out to you guys. Again, I'm trying to do these little episodes where just, you know, things come to my mind I can talk about. I'm super excited, guys. My videos have been getting a lot of views. I don't know, the algorithms really liked me, but you guys have been doing something right, so please keep it up. It's awesome to see how many views we're getting. I'm super blessed to be able to run this channel. I love you all, God bless you all, and remember to like, share, subscribe, and Check me out for the next video. I'm going to be getting more of a regular uploading schedule going on. This week's just been crazy. Love you all and have a good one.